A transformer on a pole near a factory steps the voltage down from 3600 volts RMS to 120 volts RMS. The transformer is to deliver 1900 kilowatts to the factory at 90% efficiency. Find the find values for the following. The power delivered to the primary, the current in the primary, and the current in the secondary. So here's what we got to do. It's, it tells us how much power is being delivered in the secondary. Now in an ideal current, the power in the primary is going to equal the power in the secondary. But this tells us that we have a reduction of efficiency of 90%. So we're saying that the, the power in the primary, P1, is equal to, is, or, so the, it, it stepped down 90%. So 90% uh, of P1 of the power in the primary is equal to P2. So I can re replace this percent sign and make this 0.9 P1 equals P2. So how much is the power in the primary? So power in the primary is equal to P2 divided by 0.9. And so P, uh, P2, it tells us, is 1900. You divide that by 0.9. The power in the primary uh, is 2111.111 kilowatts. Then it wants us to solve for the current in both cases. And so the current, the, whenever you relate power to current, power is equal to the current squared times the resistance. And, uh, and, and so then we don't, know what the, uh, we don't know what the resistance is, so we have to eliminate it. So we use Ohm's law, V equals IR, and we solve for R. So V over I equals R. Then we plug this in right here. And so what we get is that P is equal to I squared times V over I. And that cancels one of these out, and I get P is equal to I times V. We know what the current or what the power is, but we don't know what the current is. So P over V equals I. For the power in the primary circuit, I'm going to use or for the current in the primary circuit, I'm going to use the primary power, 2111.11. For the the current in the secondary circuit, I'm going to use the power in the secondary circuit of 1900. Now it tells us in the problem that the voltage originally is transmitted at 3600, so I'll use V1 for my, for my voltage in the first equation, and then it's transformed down to 120 volts, so on the second equation I'll use 120. So, so what this will look like for my first equation, I'll have my I'll have my power of 2111.11. I'll divide it by my voltage of 3600. And that will equal my, and so make sure you convert this to SI units. That's in kilowatts. So you want to times it by 10 to the third. And that would give me a primary, uh, a primary current of 586.4198. If you don't trans, uh, change this to SI units, you get 0.5. And then in the, the secondary current, so the secondary current, my equation becomes uh, 1900 divided by 120. And then I gotta change this into SI units by multiplying it by 10 to the third. And so the current should be 15,833.33 amps. Hey, thanks for watching. Make sure you check out my blog. The link is down in the About section of this video. And on the blog, you'll find cool stuff like other videos for the same chapter. And you'll also find uh, little download links where you can download calculators to uh, basically just punch in your numbers and solve these exact problems. So you won't even have to watch the video if you don't want to. The last thing I want to say is if you leave comments on YouTube, of course I will get around to responding, but I'm much faster if you leave them at the bottom of my blog, right down there. Enjoy your day.